Yeah, I mean, we, we heard about this place in, in South America that was a tabletop mountain that had plants and animals that didn't exist anywhere else, and it was a pure straight drop and very old. And we thought, well, that parallels our character. Our the character is sort of the same, that he's old and isolated, and we thought that'd be a good place to conduct our story. So 11 or 12 of us got on a plane and went down. I forget how many of us went, but we drew, we took pictures, and the nice thing about doing research is that you, you have a vocabulary of how to speak of the place your character is going to go. And it also, it also created situations for us. How would an old man go over these rocks or how would an old man react to that waterfall? So it helped us to define the story. We needed somewhere that, that they would get stuck, that they couldn't, Carl couldn't just turn to a policeman and say, here, take this kid, I'm, I'm off. Uh, we needed somewhere that felt very adventurous and distant and exotic. Yeah. And so, you know, when we came across this location of these amazing tabletop mountains, it was just like, wow, this is this is made for what we what we want in the movie. Uh, it's basically a bunch of uh, particles. So you have all these individual pieces that are, are you know, generated and projected off of this ledge. And then each particle is shaded in a way to look like a soft little fuzzy bit, uh, to look like water. And the guy who did it had done uh, waterfalls on cars He did as the well. cars waterfall, yeah, which and is a big... He just knocked our socks off the first time. I mean, it just looks so beautiful. One thing we did was to s experiment with the speed. Yeah, we scaled the speed up and down. Yeah, because when you watch <clears throat> a real waterfall, like uh, Angel Falls, it's so big, so tall, that by the time the water falls to the bottom, it's dissipated into mist. It doesn't roar down like, like you're used to. Um, and you watch it, and it almost looks like it's in slow motion. It's just so big. The scale of it is so big. So that's where we started with that sort yeah. of reality. But during the shot, you looked at it and you're like, is it even moving? I can't tell. So we sped it up a little bit. That was the one thing I remember that we played 